Hi guys, I am Trisha with Insectopia, here to talk to you about the spiny leaf insect, sometimes called the Australian walking stick. Most of these individuals are found in Australia, but they can also be found in New Guinea. These insects are fascinating because of their relationship with ants and their defensive mechanisms. The adult female spiny leaf insect is pretty good at camouflaging into its surroundings. They look like spiny leaves, and the adult female's abdomen is normally curled over her body to look like a dried leaf. They have a behavior where they will wave back and forth, so they appear to be blowing in the wind. The adult female mostly stays in one place and does not have a quick escape plan. The male walking stick actually has wings and can fly. He will fly until he finds a female to mate with, although the female can lay viable eggs with or without the male. The ability of a female animal to lay eggs without mating is called parthenogenesis. Without being mated, the eggs will all be female. After she is mated, the eggs will be a mixture of both male and female. The female will use her curved abdomen to flick her eggs to the ground. The eggs of the spiny leaf insect are shaped like rounded barrels and each have a knob. These eggs look a little like seeds. The knob of the egg is actually edible for ants and will attract them. Ants will forage for seeds and pick up the eggs and pile them in their food storage. The ants will eat the knob and put the still intact egg into their waste chamber. This is helpful for the eggs because the ants are protecting them from predators. And obviously, this relationship is good for the ants as they get food out of the deal. When the nymph spiny leaf insect hatches, it is small, leggy, and mostly black other than its red head. The first instar is an ant mimic. This nymph looks just like an ant and will use that to its advantage. It will run to the surface and climb up into a tree. This is where they will eat and mature and gain their natural light brown color. Check out these real life pictures of the spiny leaf insect. On the left, you can see the spiny leaf insect's eggs. And on the right, you can see the nymph that is an ant mimic. On the left, you can see the adult female, and on the right, you can see the adult male. Thank you for listening. If you have any questions about the spiny leaf insect or a thought of what species you would mimic if you had a chance, let us know in the comment section below. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos like this one. I will be posting videos frequently. Come back soon and check out our next epic insect tale.